Hello and a very warm welcome to our YouTube channel Corrosion Control and Inspections. We will be sharing informative videos on various corrosion, inspection, welding, metallurgy, coatings and paintings as well as asset integrity related topics. Your valuable feedback will be important for us. Do not forget to like, share, comment and subscribe to our channel. Press bell icon to keep yourself notified about upcoming In this video, you will get to know an overview about various American Petroleum Institute tanks. This video will provide clarification for those of you in the metal fabrication industry regarding the key differences between a P standard 620 and 650 for storage tanks. What are American Petroleum Institute, API, tanks? What is American Petroleum Institute 650 tank? What is American Petroleum Institute 620 tank? What is the difference between American Petroleum Institute 650 and 620 tanks? The American Petroleum Institute, often referred to as API, has dictated the construction-based requirements of an API tank. These construction requirements are dependent on various parameters which includes tank size, location, and stored material characteristics. API standards also dictate various materials and processes used during construction and welding as well as tanks testing procedures. Special elements such as nozzle reinforcement pads and structural supports are properly detailed in various API standards. API tanks typically store oil, gasoline, and chemicals but may hold any other type of liquid such as water. Certain process media may require application of an internal coating. In contrast to ASME pressure vessels which primarily exist for processing, API tanks exist primarily for storage purposes. The API 650 is the American standard for welded flat-bottomed vertical storage tanks. This standard dictates tank design, manufacture, welding, inspection and installation requirements. The API 650 is widely used for tanks designed to withstand low internal pressures, for the storage of typical products such as crude oil, petrol, chemicals and water. Materials of construction are typically carbon steel, austenitic duplex stainless steel, and aluminum. The API 650 is commonly used for tanks designed to withstand low internal pressures. They are typically used for the storage of typical products such as crude oil, petrol, chemicals and water. API 620 Design and Construction of Large, Welded, Low Pressure Storage Tanks is a standard developed and published by the American Petroleum Institute that gives requirements for the design and construction of large, welded storage tanks with pressures in their gas or vapor spacers. API 620 tanks see large wells and applications for highly pressurized fluids like natural gas and provide storage at relatively lower temperatures. These tanks require either an elevated or flat bottom with a tank minimum thickness of 3 16 of an inch. Typically the 620s material of construction is a steel alloy. The API 620 fits products that require high internal pressure such as liquefied natural gas LNG, and cryogenic tanks. This type of tank can store any liquid.
The most popular tanks available on the market today are the ones made by American Petroleum Institute and are referred to as API 620 and API 650 models. API 620 regulates the design and manufacture of large steel low-pressure storage tanks, usually larger than 300 feet in diameter. By contrast, API Standard 650 is typically used for carbon, stainless steel and aluminum tanks located in terminals, refineries, pipelines and other process facilities. API 620 can store contents at a lower temperature and higher pressure whereas API 650 permits a lower amount of pressure at a higher temperature. Thanks for visiting our channel. We will be sharing informative videos on various corrosion and asset integrity related topics. Your valuable feedback will be important for us. Do not forget to like, share, comment and subscribe to our channel. Press bell icon to keep yourself notified about upcoming videos.